and exhale deeply to your mouth. And when you're ready, I want to keep the top leg up to the 90 degree again. And we want to rest a little bit by working your bottom leg again. Dorsi flex with you. Xin chào, welcome to Pilates with Hannah. Winter time must be leg time because we tend to sleep and sit so much more in the cold weather. And I know how great it feels to grab yourself up in a blanket all day. So today we will work out to strengthen and tone your whole legs in order to make it a long lean leg that you always wanted. So if you're ready, just try your mat and let's begin. Alright, now let's start by allow yourself to lie all the way down on one side and we're going to start with the psychic series. So use your hand to support your head and use the other hand in front of your chest. Lengthen your legs to the front and keep your hips stabilized, pull the belly button in, shoulders far away from your ears. Now I want you to inhale and lift your leg just above the hips and then bring it back 10 times with your own breath. Nine belly button in, squeezing your thighs, do it with control here. So contract your pelvic floor muscles and don't make it any easy here. If you feel it's so easy, then probably you haven't engaged all the muscles at one. So keep breathing, lift and down and th four, three, two, and then last one. Now lift it up just above the hips again, dorsiflex with your feet. Inhale, lift your leg as high as you can and exhale, bring it down. Inhale, up and exhale down and feel free to rest your head on your arm by lengthening your arm down to the mat if you need to. And seven, six, belly button in, five, four, three. Make sure you always engage your core to support your lower back. Now last one, lift and slowly bring your leg down. From here, I want you to allow yourself to lift your legs up just above the mat again. Press your hand down, really put your shoulders far away from your ears. Now try to keep your leg parallel to the floor and bring your leg to the front. Exhale, bring it back. Inhale, pull the belly button in, press your bottom leg down to the mat and squeeze your thighs. Make sure your hips stabilize and only your leg is moving now. Press both hands down to the mat for more support. Inhale, and exhale, come back. And six more times, stay with your own breath. Belly button in, squeeze in the thighs. Five, four, inhale, and exhale, come back. Three, keep breathing here with your own breath. And two more times, inhale, and exhale. And last one, and slowly bring it back to the center. Now, I wanted to inhale and slowly lift your leg just about to the hips again. Just about the hips again and plantar flex with your foot. Inhale and bring one knee to chest. And exhale, lengthen it to the front. Inhale. And exhale, come back. Keep breathing here with your own breath. And belly button in. Lengthen. And then come back. And five more times here. Very good. Four, inhale, and exhale. Three, two, now last one. And slowly bring your leg down. Shake your hips a little bit. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply to your mouth. All right, now from here, I wanted to allow yourself to bring your top leg to 90 degree and dorsiflex with your feet. And inhale, lift your leg up. Exhale, bring it back. We're going to feel your inner thigh is working here. Squeeze your inner thighs, contract your pelvic floor muscles. And if you can squeeze your booty muscles at the same time. So stabilize your hips, really pull your belly button in six more times with your own breath. Five, shoulders far away from your ears. Four, three, and two. Now last one, and slowly, Bring your leg down, lengthen the top leg again. We just take a little bit rest with the top leg here. And now from here, you can soften your bottom knee if you need to. Inhale and lift your leg up just above the hips again. Now, I wanted to 
activate your foot so you can plantar flex or you can um, dorsiflex as long as you activate it and now rotate your knees up towards the ceiling now inhale and lift your leg as high as you can with your knees still facing to the outside and then bring it back squeeze your thighs you're going to do it nine more times with your own breath and keep breathing feel your leg is shaking here and try to bring it down slowly with control inhale and exhale come back and six belly button all the way in five four three squeeze in the thighs try to lengthen your leg all the way towards the front two more times with your own breath and last one inhale all the way up and exhale slowly bring it down and bend your knees shake your hips a little bit here now to the next movement i wanted to lengthen your legs all the way up to the front here and inhale lift it up as high as you can exhale bring it down just above the hips inhale lift and exhale down we're going to do it for eight more times see with your own breath seven six feel your legs your hips are shaking but your whole side the outer thigh is working here and your booty muscles at the same time beautiful keep breathing here with your own breath and five four three two now last one slowly bring your legs down bend your knees again shake your hips inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply to your mouth and when you're ready i wanted to keep the top leg up to the 90 degree again and we want to rest a little bit by working your bottom leg again dorsi flex with your feet now inhale and lift your bottom leg just above just up above the mat here bring your leg to the front and bring it back inhale engage your core as much as possible and stabilize your torso here you can feel your leg is shaking your core is working at the same time make sure your shoulders are always far away from your ears seven six always keep it above the mat five belly button in and four engage your core as much as possible three try to lift your leg a little bit higher if you can to really feel it working and last one inhale to the front exhale come back and bring your leg down shake your hips inhale deeply to your nose bend both knees again and exhale deeply to your mouth now lift your knees up inhale and lengthen lift it up exhale bring it down inhale all the way up and exhale slowly bring it down here with your own breath keep breathing in eight seven six and five four three two squeeze in the thigh always keep your heel higher than your knee and last one lift and slowly bring both knees and heels down shake your hips inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply to your mouth all right now come back to the very basic movement but very effective at the same time lift your knee up with your heels still sticking to each other and then come back inhale lift squeeze in the thighs and bring your knee back to the center and up and down and seven six five four belly button in three two and last one lift slowly bring it down shake your hips inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth and when you're ready i wanted to go to your opposite side okay and your hands support your head again lengthen your leg to the front or you can rest your hand all the way down rest your head on your hand here so i wanted to inhale and slowly lengthen your legs activate your feet lift your leg just above the hips and then bring it down press your bottom knee down so you can always soften your bottom knee if you need to and it, it make you feel easier to keep balance now make sure your hips not lean backward or lean forward just really keep hip on hip and belly button in here squeeze in the thighs contract your pelvic floor muscles and shoulders far away from your ears and three two inhale lift exhale down the last one and slowly 
bring it down. Now lift your leg up above the hips again. Dusty flex with your feet. Inhale, lift it all the way up and exhale, bring it down. Inhale, as high as you can. Exhale, come back. Pull the belly button in seven more times with your own breath. And six. Slowly, five. Four. Squeeze in the thighs, contract your pelvic floor muscles always. Two. And the last one, keep breathing and don't hold your breath. Bring your legs down, shake your hips a little bit. Now lift your leg up again, dusty flex, and really press your hands down to keep balance and stabilize your torso here. Bring your leg just to the front and then come back. Make sure your leg is still parallel to the floor. Activate your foot. And you can soften your bottom knee if you need to, if it's easier for you. Keep breathing, seven. Squeeze in the thighs. Six, belly button in, and make sure only your leg is moving. Every movement start from your hips. Your torso stabilize, your hips stabilize. Very good. Lengthen your neck still. Inhale and exhale. And three, two, and last one. Inhale and exhale. Come back and bring your legs down. Shake your hips again. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. And now from here, I want to bend your knee, bring your knee towards the chest, and then lengthen to the front, and then come back. So again, make sure you can always soften your knee, your bottom knee here, and press it down to the mat. Inhale. And exhale, lengthen. And seven. Try to activate your foot here. Six. And five. Four belly button in. Three. Keep breathing. And two more times with your own breath. Now last one. And slowly bring your leg down. Shake your hips. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Alright. And now your top leg bend to 90 degree. Your bottom leg dorsiflex. flex. Inhale lift it up. Exhale bring it down. Inhale lift. And exhale down. Eight more times with your own breath. And again, feel your inner thigh is working here. And five, four, three, two, and last one. Lift and slowly bring it down and lengthen your legs to the front again. Now, I wanted to allow yourself to soften your bottom knee, lift your leg up as far as you can, and start dorsiflex flex with your foot, rotate your knee. To this side and now lift it up higher and then bring it down inhale lift and exhale down always keep your foot activate here with plant up a dorsi flex so keep breathing and six belly button all the way in five four really contract your pelvic floor muscles and pull the belly button in to support your lower back two and last one Lift and slowly bring your legs down. Move both legs to the front to create a 90 degree on your hips here. Dorsi flex with your feet. Now inhale and lift your leg, your top leg just above the hip again. Now lift it up as high as you can and bring it down. And nine, eight, squeeze in the thighs. Seven, keep breathing here with your own breath. Six and five, four, belly button in three, two shoulders all the way far away from your ears and slowly bring your legs down with your head to massage if you need to and now we're going to rest your top leg again by bending your top leg to 90 degree and dorsi flex with your bottom foot lengthen lift it up try to move it towards the front and then come back always keep it at the same height and move it with control so inhale and exhale come back Engage your core as much as possible. Beautiful. And six more times here. Five. Squeeze your thighs. Four. Belly button in. Three. Very good. And two. And the last one. And slowly bring your legs down. Lengthen. Shake your hips. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale. Bend both knees up to 90 degrees here. Now inhale and 
lift your heels up higher than the knees and always keep it here try to lift the top leg up and leg down and lift without changing the angle on your knee so keep breathing inhale all the way up and exhale slowly bring it down lift and down and five four three two and the last one lift try to reach as high as you can and slowly bring it down and come back to the last movement on this psychic series open your knees wider and then come back inhale and exhale and open and bring it back six more times with your own breath five four three two and last one and slowly shake your hips inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth rotate your ankle a little bit and then reverse inhale and exhale all right now i wanted to allow yourself to sit up and sit along the mat so bend your knees and lengthen your spine bring your arms all the way towards the front inhale slide back to open your chest and you slowly bring it backward here lengthen your legs and then bring it back slide your heel towards your ankle and then come back now if you're a beginner you can always put your hand behind your hips close your elbow to the back and move and bring it back and nine more times here with your own breath eight seven keep breathing beautiful six inhale and exhale five belly button in try to bring your heel towards your hips as far as you can and come back in three two and the last one and slowly lengthen allow yourself to lie all the way down on your back here now i want you to inhale and bring your legs all the way up to the ceiling dorsi flex with your feet open your arm to the side and open your leg to the side start to make a little pulls 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lengthen your legs all the way up. Inhale, open. And exhale, come back. Inhale. And exhale. And seven more times here. Keep breathing. 5, 4, 3, 2. Now, last one. Bring it back. Pull your toes all the way up to the sky, to the ceiling, and plant up, flex with your feet. Now inhale and slowly bend your one knee down, bring one leg down without changing the angle on your knees, and then keep it back. Inhale, and exhale, pull the belly button in. For more support, you can always put your arms along your body here. In six, five, four, three, two, now last one and come back lengthen to your opposite side bring it down and then lift stabilize your hips pull the belly button in inhale and exhale come back very good make sure your shoulder blades down to the mat in five four three two and the last one and bring it back hug your knee to your chest shake your hips a little bit rotate your ankle and reverse all right now the next movement i want you to lengthen your legs all the way up again now keep your feet plantar flex here and i want you to open your arms to the side now inhale and slowly open your legs to the side and bring it back to the center again now inhale open and exhale come back and do it for a couple more times with your own breath inhale and exhale And five, four, try to lengthen your leg all the way up to the ceiling. Activate your feet always, squeeze in your thighs to bring your legs back to the center. And five more times here. Four, three, two, 
pull the belly button in to support your lower back. And last one. And slowly hug your knee to your chest. Shake your hips. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply to your mouth. Now put your feet down. Try to open your knees wider than your hips. Start to make a little pulse. So 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. And run slowly. Bring your knees back. Lift your legs up. And to 90 degree again. And now slowly bring one leg down. And open. And then move it towards the chest. And bring it back. And lift. Inhale. And move. Exhale. Come back and close. I'm going to do it eight more times with your own breath. Six. And five. Four. Belly button in. Three. Keep breathing. And two more times with your own breath. Activate your foot. Now last one. Open. And slowly switch to the other side. Open. Move it. And then come back. Inhale. Open. And exhale. Bring it back. Very good. Keep breathing here with your own breath. And five. Squeeze your thighs. Contract your pelvic floor muscles. Four. Contract and engage your core as much as possible. Shoulder blades always down to support your lower back. And three. Two. And the last one. And slowly bring your legs down. Shake your hips. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply to your mouth. All right. Now I want you to allow yourself to keep your arms along your body. Lengthen your leg up to the ceiling again. Bring it down and lengthen to the side. Draw a half of the circle and then come back. Inhale down. Exhale draw and lift. Inhale. And exhale. Do it with control. So really put your hips down to the mat. And a couple more times here. Inhale. And exhale. And four, three, two, and last one, slowly with your own breath, and back to the center, shake your hips, lift your opposite leg up, inhale, bring it down to the side, and then come back, inhale, and come back, very good, keep breathing. Six and five. The bigger the circle is, the more challenging your legs are. So really listen to your body and I want you to try to push yourself a little bit more, just a little bit to the part that you still feel good. Now last one. And slowly bend your knees, hug your knees to your chest. Inhale deeply to your nose. Exhale deeply through your mouth and rotate your ankles in the reverse. Bring your feet down, shake your hips a little bit and then bring one leg up, dusty flex with your foot. Start to make a little pulse with your leg here in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and to the other side. Lengthen up, dusty flex, make a little pulse again. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and slowly hug your knee to your chest. Rotate your ankle, inhale deeply to your nose, and exhale deeply to your mouth. Shake your hips. Lean on one side to sit up. And that's the work of today. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe and hit the bell to see notification every time when I upload a new video. And I will appreciate if you give it a thumbs up if you really enjoy it. So see you tomorrow. Bye.